to find out about the push to get more Latino voters to the polls. Kelly. Yeah, and according to community leaders, uh, one in every four voters in San Diego County is Latino. Now, even though that number is high, uh, they say voter turnout in this population is low. So today, the national city mayor uh, urged her constituents to get out and vote. We've been disproportionately impacted by COVID-19, and we're the essential workers. We're the ones who have kept food on the table the people who have cared for our families and the neighbors that have called us during this uh, pandemic. And that was National City Mayor Alejandra Sotelo Solis speaking at a news conference at Montgomery Waller Community Park today. Now, more than 800,000 voters have cast their ballots in San Diego County, uh, but she says a very small number of them are Latino. Why? Well, the director of Alliance San Diego says, for one, there's a language barrier. There hasn't been a lot of information in Spanish, and though there's lots of talk on who to vote for, there hasn't been a lot of talk about how to vote. So Mayor Sotelo Solis and other organizers are making a final push today, urging people to drop off their mail-in ballots or to head to the polls tomorrow. A young Latinx voter I spoke to told me there is a lot at stake. Our community is greatly affected. If we want our, if we want actual change and we want decisions to be made in the way that we want them to be, then we ourselves have to go out there and vote. And that young lady you heard from right there, she is a student at Mesa College, and she told me she's had to convince a lot of her family and friends to get out and vote. She said the sentiment right now is just that people think they don't have time or people think that uh, their vote really doesn't matter because they're just uh, one person here in the state of California.